Hey there friends, uh, we are up with another video in breaking into the PM series and in today's video we will be covering what are product internships, what do they look like, what is the role all about, what kind of stipend is there in you know product management internships and also the best ways to apply for these internships right. So let's get started very quickly, I'm gonna you know include many examples for my internships so it's gonna take some time, right? So the first question that comes in is, what does the role look like? Usually, the companies that hire for software uh, and product roles are startups, right? The internship roles. So in these companies, there might be a product that we are looking at, which has a specific user journey. It's it has to be majorly a software product, so that you can also get a report internship. Now, uh, in software products, there's onboarding, there's the customer journey through the app, and then there's the offboarding or the revenue or the payment, right? Usually, interns don't uh, go with the offboarding, growth, payments, and all that. We usually work with the onboarding and the user journey. So, for example, at my company, the company which I work in, uh, I had to deal with uh, how the user was onboarded to the app. It was a mental health app. And how could I, you know, reduce the XYZ number of steps uh, for the onboarding so that I could onboard more users, right? Uh, so you, I can optimize the user journey. Similarly, for product internship roles, there are two to three kind of things that you might be doing. Either you'll be writing PRDs. So for example, in my role uh, in an insurance company that I'm working in, my first one of the few tasks uh, in the starting month was to write PRD for travel insurance, right? So product requirement document for travel journey and travel insurance for hell of Zindagi. So that was something and that I did. That was the first kind that's writing PRDs and documents or okay, case studies and, and market research, right? The second part comes is in design. So you might have to design mockups or wireframes. So that's the second thing. Third part, uh, is as I told on the user journey part, you might have to optimize something that's already existing. So it could be user journey in the app. Uh, it could be X, Y, Z amount of steps that the user has to do to do a specific task. So you might have to optimize it and reduce it. You might also work on content for some time. So there are just a lot of things that uh, you work in. You take small parts of it and you don't really own the product, right? From the company side, but as a product intern, I would definitely say that, you know, from your personal end, try to own the product, try to look for inaccuracies, try to look for, uh, you know, the things that are not good from the customer's perspective and report them to your manager. It, it uh, even, you know, if even if you're not uh, looking forward to stay in the company, it definitely helps the product and it, it makes you a good product manager, right? So this is what the product role looks like in terms of internships now the best way to apply for these internships is through linkedin and through slack linkedin i don't meet the job section uh there's a detailed video on how to in apply for product internships you can check it on pm school's youtube channel uh but i'll tell you very briefly so there are two ways either you join these communities for example pm school PM School has their separate channel on Slack with the name Jobs and Hiring. So every day there are a few jobs that are posted and many times there are internships. So best way, one of the best ways to apply is through that job section. So it goes the same for other communities as well. The other way is go make a good network on LinkedIn with product managers, with product interns. So whenever they post, product managers often post that they need two interns for their team or their product. So they post it directly on LinkedIn. They don't post it as a job. They rather post it directly on LinkedIn and then they give an assignment to solve. So you can reach out through those posts. So you can search these posts. You can stay in network with product managers and then you can, you, you know, just get hired. Through. So these are the two very, these ways are where the probability is very high to get hired. The post might be hard to find, but if you find a good post, there's a major probability that you will get hired. Uh, coming on to the next question, what's the stipend and what type of companies there are? There are tech companies majorly who, who are hiring 
for product management interns there are companies that deal with operations right for example there's front row there's house of being uh, there's contlo there's a, an academy uh, many companies are there who need someone uh, to handle their operations as well so they these guys they hire for product ops role product ops role is also a very good way to break into product management where your role is kind of very similar to the product management intern role and it's comparatively easier to break in as well so product ops role many companies the stipend usually ranges from 10 to 25k that's the average there are of course corner cases and there are companies that pay a little less and there are of course companies that pay up to 70k per month for pm internships so that's totally on you and the companies and never you know never get demotivated i mean the first internship that i did paid me more than what i get paid for the internship right now but right now i know that the scope of this internship is more i'm going to get to learn more and that's why i'm doing it right so uh, don't go for stipend rather see what the scope looks like uh what you are looking to learn in this opportunity and the, that will help you a lot to figure it out uh so that's it for today's video uh do check out our previous videos that are what skills are needed for product management internship and how to apply for pm roles uh you will find it at the same vertical and that's it for today so make sure to share this video it's it's going to be helpful for many of your friends for you as well make sure to like share and subscribe we post every friday mornings so stay tuned and crack your pm internship see ya bye bye